Okay, good afternoon. Uh, welcome to my daily broadcast. My name is Barry Selby. Um, where should I begin? Let me start with telling you who I am, what I'm about. I am a best-selling author, speaker, and relationship attraction expert, helping strong, successful women find balance in love, life, and business. I'm also a passionate champion for the divine feminine. And pretty much every day now, at least for the last 11 months, getting close to that, um, I do a daily Facebook Live. This is number 332. And the series of talks is called Messages from the Masculine to Inspire the Feminine Heart. Today's broadcast actually was inspired by conversation, as they usually are. And I'm calling this one, it's the way it's, it's, the way it's describing coaching. And the way I'm describing it is coaching is like being your helicopter. And I will explain what that means. Um, let me start by saying it this way. I'll put this in a simple way. <coughs> I'm going to choke the words out. Okay, so here's one part. How is it that when your best friend gives you advice, you won't take it? But when a perfect stranger does, you listen. Which is, by the way, very common. It's not, very, it's not unusual at all for that to happen. Why is it the people closest to us we won't listen to? But somebody who doesn't know us that well, who's more dispassionate, we trust implicitly with what they say. Maybe, it's not true about everybody, just to be clear. But the truth is that we, tend to try, we don't tend to trust people close to us. And I believe the reason is, for most of us, is that they're too enmeshed with what we're about and who we are to get the, fa- the clarity. In fact, they're almost... Well, I'll use this analogy and we'll play see how it goes. So, the analogy... Oh, you're welcome, Bert, Rebecca. I appreciate it. Brad, nice to see my broadcast for change. My 332nd broadcast, sir. I've been doing this for a while. Um, the idea about coaching, let me start with this, this framework, is imagine, if you will, you're driving down these city streets and there's skyscrapers everywhere and you've got a friend in the car. Nine times out of ten, your friend won't have any different insight about where you're going than you will. You can't see beyond the block, basically, because there's, there's, cross, there's buildings everywhere. But if you had somebody in a helicopter flying above you, who was above the buildings, they could see your navigation and see where you need to go. They'll see where you've been, where you're stuck, they'll land traffic jams ahead of you. Like a, it's not a GPS, it's like a satellite or a traffic helicopter in a way. That's what coaching is like. Huh? <laughs> you may be thinking. The truth is simple, and if you watch what the coach, you know this to be the fact. A coach is someone who can be your um, your scout, your, high, your higher viewpoint. A coach brings to the table a different perspective that is usually much more um, circumspect, if that's the right word, certainly have, have a, a bigger view, a higher viewpoint of where you want to be and where you're going. And if you find a good coach, they have really good vision. So they see where you've been, they see where you are, and they see where you want to go. And like a helicopter flying above the car, you can, I can see, as, the, as your coach, where it is you're heading to go, and also showing where the challenges are ahead so you know where to get there safely and expediently too. This may be the simplest way I can describe what a truly um, effective use a coach can be for you in your life. Whatever area you're in, I'm not speaking about my own work necessarily, but true if you're looking for a business coach or a health coach or any other sort of coach, relationship coach like myself, having someone who's got that altitude and that ability to see further than you can see is why you would pay them to be your guide, so they can get you where you want to go as expediently as possible. Because if you're doing it on your own without the help, you can make 17,000 wrong turns, end up before, back where you started, or further back from where you started, and never get where you want to go. And for some of you, that, you know that experience. And I've been there myself in the past, which is why I work with a coach. Yes, in, as a coach, I work with a coach, because their vision goes beyond mine. And truth be told, and this is what I want to suggest to you, if you're looking to work with a coach, make sure they have their own coach. Because nobody knows everything. And nobody is top of the heap, ultimately. We're always learning from somebody else. And if we're not choosing to learn from somebody else, our growth is limited. So if you're working with a coach, make sure they're working with a coach as well. Because that way you know your coach is always growing to be ahead of you and stay ahead of you. Because otherwise, you'll pass your coach. In which case, why would you want to be with them? That was a very brief exposition about coaching and why it works and what doesn't work. <laughs> But just take this analogy to heart. 
if you want to work with somebody who can help you, you want to be with somebody who can see further than you can, can guide you the right way to get where you want to go, and can see a destination for you, and then with you, and then help you get there. That is support that really works. So I'll say it this way. I'll happily be your helicopter when it comes to love and relationships. <laughs> if that makes any sense whatsoever. Um, I know it does. It's just a really quick, quick, quick broadcast. I'm realizing it was like the shortest broadcast I've done in ages. But I just want to get this point now because I'm realizing for many people, they're going, what does a coach do in relationships? How do they help you? That is the, the um, I say this, that is really the framework of how I play is that I know where you're going. I feel for you. I want to support you in getting where you want to go. And that altitude allows me to see more dispassionately as well. So I'm not in the pit with you because you may be in a pit of challenge, despair, upset, frustration, hurt feelings. You want somebody who's not going to be in the pit with you. You want someone who can help you out of the pit. And that's the altitude you want. So in any area of your life that you want to get some support in, find someone that can help you who's been the road further, who's been up higher up, who can get a better perspective, who can be your helicopter, as it were. I'm thinking about maybe changing my brain into helicopter coaching, but that would be... No, that just... <laughs> I hope that analogy works for you. It does for me. Um, speaking of which, if you would like to find out how I could be your helicopter... <laughs> I'm just going to kick out saying that. Um, I do offer a complimentary clarity conversation. It's my gift to you. Complimentary being free. Um, go to my website, go to barrysilver.com, click on Let's Chat, which is the left-hand menu choice, and sign up for a discovery session. It's my gift to you, 30-minute conversation where I can help you with some clarity, some direction, and help you with your next steps. Um, if this broadcast speaks to you, thank you. Let me know in the comments below what you thought of it, if it makes sense to you. If it doesn't make sense to you, either way. If you know anybody should watch this, please share it with them. And as always, my broadcasts are available because it's number 332 in an ongoing series of talks on my business page, which is barryselby.author on Facebook. They also end up on YouTube because I do put them there as well. And that is um, channel is Barry Selby. Playlist is Messages from the Masculine. And also on my website on the video blog. So I hope this makes sense to you. And I hope you take this to heart. Marcia, nice to see you. You may want to watch the replay of this because I'm just summary, summarizing. It's a very quick explainer about coaching in a very different way. Um, and it's the weekend so I'm not giving homework this weekend <laughs> I didn't give it yesterday, I didn't give it today by the way, if you haven't watched my broadcast from Friday and Saturday, which was 3.30 and 3.31 um, one of them was ladies um, are you still dating men, weak men are you still dating weak men is what I said worth watching if you have been dating weak men ladies the second one was, which is a big wake up call for a lot of men and women, which I think was that was Friday's one, which was um why men won't commit in or out. You have to watch it to find out more about that. So thank you for watching. Thanks for being with me. I will be back in tomorrow with something maybe more uh, robust, deeper, challenging. We'll see. I, I don't know what... These topics are never planned ahead. This one came to me about an hour ago. So that's why I'm doing it now. So thanks for being with me. I'll see you again tomorrow. Take care of yourselves. Bye.